Hey guys, how you doing? It's Anthony Gargaro. Super excited to announce where we're at today. It's called the Village Workshop here in downtown Northville. A true incubator for success and entrepreneurship. Wait till you see what we have in store for you today. what the Village Workshop is and maybe how it was created and where the concept or idea came from? Sure. Uh, actually, it was my father, Dennis Engerer, uh, teamed up with Brian Donovan. So my dad, he's a local businessman. He's been here his whole life. Uh, has Northwood Physical Rehab. And um, it was really just a dream. He was one of those really handy guys making go-karts when he was a kid. And uh, this whole makerspace concept is kind of new. You may have heard of it. There's uh, some other models like Tech Shop in Detroit. But uh, it, it was really just kind of a vision to bring the handiwork, something which is, seems to be kind of lost on uh, today's generation of students who aren't quite as familiar with shop class. Right. Uh, it's to just bring that capacity back into downtown Northville as a, a fun place for people to build their own projects and um, you know small businesses to start up. Uh, so it's it's really it's kind of a almost a social entrepreneurship in the sense that there's kind of a greater vision other than just a business model. Well, it's it's a, the idea has actually evolved. It started out as purely a maker space. So that's a place where you can come and use equipment, almost like a gym. You uh, take safety classes. You become competent at the machinery. So whether that's wood shop, welding, sewing, the entire we've got over a million dollars of equipment out back. And at that point, you're free to do whatever you want, whether that's make a cutting board uh, for your wife for Mother's Day, or um, you can also take project classes, so we have these kind of pre-made things which you can walk home with at the end of the class. We've actually got co-working space uh, upstairs right now. So this is a place where startups, entrepreneurs, small businesses, or not so small businesses, can come and rent micro office space. Right. So instead of having to go get your own dedicated industrial space, uh, you can start out like bare bones minimalistic. And of course today, we're moving more and more towards the freelance economy, uh, where all you need is a desk, a computer, an internet connection, and of course we've got the heavy industrial stuff out back. So uh, shipping and receiving, a high-low. The one thing that the Village Workshop has that no other makerspace or co-working space has is the fusion of the two. What does Northville mean to you? Why is this such a special place to not only do business, but live? I've always got the feeling that Northville is a very friendly place. Uh, you know, growing up here, I love the downtown area. And, but you've also got all sorts of professionals here. And I, I feel like the workshop kind of represents that. It's the full spectrum of um, a place where you can go to have fun, and you can also build a business. And uh, it just kind of encapsulates, I feel like it's kind of a microcosm uh, of North of a friendly, professional, clean environment. So this place is about inspiration. Right. So whether people are thinking about making a particular item and they don't know how to go about that, I have the resources to match them with a maker or with a class where they can learn how to uh, make their project themselves. So you're the liaison essentially between idea and creation. That's right. Great. Yeah, I would say that's that's a good, that's an accurate description. Uh, when I was talking with my brother back in Minnesota, he had um, suggested a maker space and to see if there were any in the Detroit area. This one was available and as soon as I drove up, because of the space, the warehouse, the natural elements of it, I was hooked. I was like, totally hooked. Yeah. And you know, something as cool as this, I just want to make a sign for my son's bedroom. I mean, th this is like a three hour class and boom, you're off to the races, uh, engraved. This looks professional. Right? Absolutely. You make something like this, it's easy. All right, so this is the workshop area. Wood shop, machine shop, metal shop, sewing. This this can all be done on our shop bot, which is a technical terminology, a three-axis CNC mill. It basically can make three-dimensional shapes as complex as you could possibly make on a computer. Uh, so 
for example, you've got the Red Wings logo. This is a, a custom 3D model off the internet. So from the simple to complex, you can make it. Yeah, and, and you can do that in any kind of species of wood. Um, you guys probably could do that on metal as well, right? So Yeah, that would be like over in the machine shop, but same concept. Yeah. yeah. So those are all different types of ideas of what that, those machines can do. This is just a taste of what you can do in the yeah. shop. Machine shop with a three axis mill again. You dream up a three dimensional shape, uh, program it into the computer, and boom, all of a sudden you're cutting aluminum or steel into a shape. And right. A piece of art or a piece of engineering. Uh, we've also got welding, uh, the heavy duty garage area, the metal shop. We've got a sheet metal break, uh, a CNC plasma cutter. Uh, out there, we've also got a paint booth, power coating booth. We've also got uh, laser engravers. Uh, we've even got some sewing. So really, a, anything that you would want to fabricate, I'd say for 99% of people, you can find the tools that you need. And of course, just general purpose stuff, you know, hammers, drills. So I live in Livonia, and I've known about the Village Workshop for a few years now. I, I took a tour a few years ago, thought it was an amazing space, and I kind of always pictured myself working out here actually. Um, and so as the opportunity to run a business in this area uh, came about, I was, I was traveling back and forth between Detroit and Ann Arbor, and in the tech scenes there, and there's a lot of cool things going on, but it just wasn't practical for me to drive downtown every day. Right. So we wanted to be close to our clients that are in this region right here on the west side of the metro area and uh, this was just a perfect space to do it. Easy onboarding, easy access, you know, downtown you can walk. Right. There's so many amenities that you can't get um, for just, you know, me being the first one from the company to land here in the area, so. That's amazing. So for all of you out there that have that idea, that you've always had that idea in the back of your head, uh, create it here, right? And then hit the Shark Tank. <laughs> that's right. Essentially. Yeah, right? Say, get in here and make something. That's the Get slogan. in here and make something. I mean, we all have, I mean, me in particular, I think everybody, every one of us sitting at home, you always have those things. Oh, why don't they make this? Or why don't they create this? Bring it to life. And usually there's no good reason. It's because nobody else has thought of it before. So, you know, oftentimes people become intimidated. Like, there, there's got to be a reason why that doesn't exist. No, it's right. because you haven't done it yet. That's so right. So you should come in here, ask questions, get your hands dirty, make mistakes, and uh, make it happen. Yeah.